Hi everyone, this is Sarah. Today I want to make an update video to let you guys know what I have been up to uh, the last few weeks. I wasn't feeling very good um, and so I didn't make any video but I crafted a lot and I also went, uh, went and go uh, shopping a lot because when I don't feel good um, I'll go shopping. <laughs> now the problem is I have shopped so much the last few weeks and I have bought so many things I'm not I don't know where to start what to use first for example I bought uh, the fuse I wanted it for such a long time and I couldn't wait to get it here so that I could make some shaker cards or, or shaker pockets or whatever well I didn't do it it's still in the packaging I didn't open it yet, <laughs> but I'm going to. Um, one by one, I'm going to use everything that I have um, collected the last few weeks. So, what I have, have I been doing? I have uh, crocheted a lot. See? So, here is the evidence. <laughs> um, I have crocheted in the past, um, I think two years ago, but only this flower nothing else and i thought these flowers are very beautiful but i couldn't remember how i did it <laughs> because i don't know any stitches i just couldn't remember so i got online and i um, find the tutorial again it's also on my pinterest page if you are um, if you want to know how to make this you find these uh, kind of flowers all over pinterest so they are so beautiful. So, then I saw a tutorial from Patricia. Hi Patricia, how are you doing girl? Hope you are feeling better. Um, Patricia, is Patricia that here on YouTube? I think everybody knows her because she is an amazing artist. She makes uh, amazing uh, crafts and projects and I love her work. And she also crochets. So I made uh, the rolled rose and she has a tutorial for this one on her channel. See? And it's a very easy rose and I think it's so beautiful. I think if you put maybe a pearl in the middle, yes, I really like that. And I made them in lots of different colors. See? And I am not a fast crocheter, <laughs> and I ha I do it uh, in front of the TV. Not that I see anything of the program that's on, because I really have to s look at my uh, <laughs> work and I have to count every stitch that I crochet. <laughs> so, but I am. This makes me happy. This box with all those uh, beautiful colors. So I always I also crochet. This ones. This is also a tutorial from Patricia. Aren't they beautiful? I think they would be beautiful as a ring, but I have to make them smaller. I don't know how, but maybe Patricia, you can help me. <laughs> and then maybe put a, a button in the middle, and then it will be a very beautiful ring. So then I made this heart confetti. Isn't this fun? I don't know why, but I just I just made it because it was easy and I love doing it and maybe I can I don't know what to do with it. Maybe I give it to my nieces or or make a chain or make some earrings maybe. I'm not sure, but I love this. See? Look at those colors. And I love the the strong colors better than the soft ones. So and then I got braver and braver <laughs> because it's almost fall. I found a tutorial for crocheting pumpkins. Look how cute. <laughs> they are also on my Pinterest page. So I have to find a few more oh a few more colors and then I can put them in a basket on my table. Aren't they fun? Really easy to make, even I can do it. So 
everybody can do it then. Really love them. So I try to make some butterflies. And then the first one is a really big one. See? And then oops. This one. It's not finished yet, this one. But this one is. And I think these little ones are super super cute. Don't you think? <laughs> and you can use them on many projects. I think I'm going to use them on my cards, maybe. Maybe I have to crochet with much thinner yarn. So, I don't, I don't know. I have to try that. But I think if I use thinner yarn, the butterfly will, will be smaller, right? Yes, yes. So, this one. Then I made all these little <laughs> little thingies not sure i think this is a tutorial from to do amy's channel not really sure but i'm gonna look it up so and then i made flowers another flower here here this one this one i love this one so, and I made this little bow, so cute, <laughs> I love it. And then what have we got? This one's, I'm not sure what, I just wanted to try something myself. See, didn't work. I made a lot of mistakes, but that's okay. Uh, you can learn from your mistakes, right? Oh, and then... This one, I, I did something wrong, not sure what. It's too <laughs> it's not laying flat, whatever I do. So maybe I can use it to make a flower or something. And then I made this one. This is a, also a tutorial I followed. But, yeah. Not perfect yet. And then this one's. And these are also flowers uh, I made from a tutorial that uh, um, Patricia made. I also did something wrong here. It's not supposed to be like this. <laughs> Patricia, I don't know what I've done, but I've made something else. So, and uh, love crocheting. And there are going to be lots of more things coming. Uh, what else have I been doing? I am going to show that in another video. But here is a sneak peek. <laughs> I have made um, some cards. See? Yay! Lots of cards. And you're never going to believe it. But I finally did it. And I'm trying to make my first pocket ladder. Now, this pocket ladder is laying like this for more than a week now on my table. I'm a bit stuck. I'm a bit overwhelmed by making pocket ladders. I don't know why, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna finish it. So, so thank you all for watching and I'll see you next time. Um, I'm not sure if you guys are interested in me uh, doing haul videos. Uh, if you are, just let me know. Okay, see you in a few minutes. Bye-bye.